another Excel chat walkthrough video. I'm your host, Kevin Kelly, and today we are going to be talking about how to calculate totals uh, in one summary sheet from values in other sheets within Excel. So without further ado, let's get right into it. So basically I have right here a grand total, and I have three other sheets with store one, store two, and store three, and they all have different mounts at D9. So all the totals are at D9 for each store, and <clears throat> What I want to do is add them all up, right? So the first way that we can do this is put equals. And if you're using Excel on a PC, and I believe it should be the same on a Mac, you can do control page up, sorry, page down in this case, and you can go find the cell that you want. And okay, that's the one I want. I'm going to click plus. I'm going to do control page down again. Here it is again, the next one, plus. Control page down, and then here it is again, and then you can hit enter from here. So as you can see, I went through each page individually, and I found the totals, and I just added them up by doing control page down. That's a keyboard shortcut, which is really useful when you want to switch back and forth between pages. And as you can see, 737.85, 737.85. Now there's other ways to do this, and we're going to talk about one more way. Um, that you can do this and you can calculate it uh, the total is based on a 3d formula as well so here you're basically it's a, it's a little bit simpler um, if you're if you know that your totals for each other store is in a specific cell so you know they're all going to be in d9 or they're all going to be in e3 or what have you wherever they're going to be if you know where they're going to be you can do equals sum store one, two, store, three, close, exclamation point, D9, close. So as you can see, in this case, I was able to reference all of the uh, other sheets by um, doing their names. It's, it, it's pretty simple because if you go from the first page, which is store one, and then to store three, it automatically includes store two since it's in between, since I used a colon. So all you have to do in this case is uh, just type in that formula, and it's really simple to use. Um, and it's easy to use the 3D formula if you know exactly where your cells are and, if, and you know they're all going to be in the same because let's say, for example, in store three, um, we accidentally put the total in D10, then we would be missing that because in our formula, we wanted to reference all of the D9 cells between these pages. So that is the way that you uh, get data from multiple sheets into a master sheet. So if you're adding things up, you can do control page down, go to the next seat, uh, go to the next sheet and reference it, or you can do a 3D formula and do it right from the summary sheet. Still have questions? Click to get help from a live Excel expert at Excel Chat.